I have been up late. Love you. The Lord started speaking to me at 12, 12 a.m. this morning in regards to the word of the Lord for this coming year. What is about to take place, where we are as a people, and where we're going. And I'm telling you, you better buckle up and you better get ready because there are some amazing events that are getting ready to take place, not for the world, but for the people of God. The world, hear me clearly, the world will be in shambles. The world will be in chaos. There's a lot that's going to take place in the world. But God is going to put His true and faithful ones, His children that love Him, in the place called Goshen. We're going to have an oasis, if you will, an oasis in the midst of the storm, in the midst of all the adversity, in the midst of the difficulty. Man, I'm feeling electricity hitting my hands right now. God is placing us, if you will, in the cleft of His rock. And we will be protected and we will have wealth. I'm not talking about chump change. I'm not talking about tips. I'm talking about wealth. I'm talking about the scripture that says that the wealth of the wicked is laid up for the righteous. I'm talking about a transfer that's getting ready to take place. Now, I know that we've talked a lot about it for years because God has said it's coming. But I tell you, if I be the anointed, if I be his apostle, ambassador of the king, if I have been called of the father for such a time as this, I tell you now that that transfer is getting ready to happen. And we are getting ready to be his hands extended. I don't want to share with my own words. Let me just get to it and share with you the word of the Lord that was given to me at 12, 12 a.m. It's uh, two and a half pages long, so it's going to take a minute. Um, and then we will end the series, Principles to the Kingdom. Amen? Kingdom Prosperity, uh, if I have time here in the next few minutes. <clears throat> and then next week, I want you to tune in because next week I'm going to do a teaching on first fruit seed, on first fruits. What does that mean? There's a lot of individuals that have taken it out of context. A lot of pastors and ministers, people that have just tried to get the money from the people to make themselves rich. Come on, I'm going to talk to you about truth with God's word about first fruits. Jesus is a first fruit of the Father. I'm not going to get into it now, but I want you to tune in next Sunday morning in person or live 1030 a.m. so that you can be a part of this new beginning of a brand new year. You have 365 days ahead of you that God is getting ready to show you His glory, His power, His might, His strength, and He's going to show off on your behalf. So first fruits, we're going to talk about it next week. Okay, so so make sure that you're tuned in at 1030 next week. But at 12, 12 a.m., the Lord spoke to me and He gave me this word. And the title is, Mega is here in a big way. Not little, not small portions, not maybe more than, more, not, not maybe just enough, but mega. Mega is here in a big way, I say. For again, I say, watch the clock and do not be dismayed. For time is on your side and in a big way. I move now for my people, I move now for my own. This is the time I shift all things and my power and my ways will be shown and known. You step now into new in every way. I tell you this is the beginning of a brand new way. You cannot fathom or understand all that I say, but I tell you now watch the clock for I move in a big way. I'm proud of you, I love you, and I know it's been difficult too, but the difficulty has to come to prepare you. I'm always here for you, and I've always been by your side and overshadowing you too. Never once in the past have I stepped away or have I left you. Nay, I say I have always and always will be with you, even until the end. As I have said in my word, yes, it's true, the steps you made were already laid and prepared just for you. 
I went before you and made the crooked path straight. I made those steps ahead of you so you would know where to go and the path to walk in, I say. My spirit leads and has always led the way. But you must listen and be receptive and in tune. This is very important for your upward ascension with me in this new day. Hear me for suddenlies, sparks and fireworks, celebrations with an array of my glory that will fall and manifest in this new day. The world will watch as I shift it all in a day. Do you hear me, children? Do you feel my heartbeat as I speak? For I say I am preparing a table. Yes, you will join me in an elaborate feast. I spread the table and I open up the treasures of heaven unto thee. The release of greatness and my signature ring I give unto thee. Do you understand my love for you? Do you understand what I'm about to do? I tell you the truth, my children, it's more than you can fathom. It's more than the word I speak of. Abundance shall be given unto you. This day has begun, but it begins in your time in the now. I say this moment of celebration shall spring forth in your now. Watch the clock, watch the clock, I say unto thee. Around and around it goes as it strikes the time that I have appointed unto thee. Prepare and get ready. Open your heart to me this day. It's more than I can give you in language for your understanding to comprehend my ways. You will march, I said, march into the year of 2024 and open doors of mega blessings in your time of now as never before. The numerals adding them up bring you to eight. Is it coincidence that you begin again with a clean and a fresh slate? <laughs> oh, I do not confuse, nor do I lead you astray. What I speak to you this day is what I mean, and I mean what I say. You are embarking now upon a year of blessing, and more than enough. In everything you do and say, I release to you opportunities and great advancement of my church in a brand new way. For I've told you before, I speak it yet again and tell you it's not man's way, but my timing, my way, and all we'll know is I've spoken again, hear me as I say. It's new, it's new, all of it's new, and I do it for you. I shift all mindsets and paradigms too. Relearning, relearning, it's time for you to. The hour is here to experience all new. All that I am and all that I have for you will be given including a reprogramming too. New revelation and insight for realms and dimensions you've never tapped into. Listen to me now and put your, your hand in mine and let me teach and train you to be synchronized in my time. Synchronized in step and ready for kingdom power. My people listen to me now for this is the manifested hour. I release so much mega blessings and instruction, wisdom that will advance you. Release the past now and let me reharmonize you too in tune and in step with me and the frequencies internal that heal, deliver, and set you free. Learn, my people, for it's all been given from me. So much I shall do, so much to release and download to you. It's, it's a year of unforgettable transitions, history written, and generations to read about the quantum shift that all shall experience and all that I do. Listen to me, listen and hear me well and plain. My government shall be established in the earth realm for what the enemy is trying to do, I say, has been insane. I will step up in a swift move and a sudden shift and blow. It'll be done so fast the enemy's camp will not even know. 
I'll disrupt the disruptors in this hour and their camps shall implode. The release of all children and self and sex traffic evildoers will be known with their full names for all to know. For I'm exposing in this hour and all shall be known. Those who have said it's hidden away, it's been done behind closed doors in secret, will not get away. I say it's checkmate now. As the Lion of Judah, I roar. I will shake it all up and those in the camp of evil will shake and hit the floor. They will be stunned in fear and trapped in their own devices that I will expose unto all. This is the season and the year of the great fall. The fall of the evil ones and yet the raising up of my faithful elite too. It's going to be done so fast it will even surprise you. My plan is brilliant, I say. No one could do it so genius and quick like this. The media will be struck and surprised what I shall do. Their time of lies and deceitful blunders, I have had it up to here. The moment of exposing all. Hear me, I say, the Spirit of the Lord, for that time is here. No one shall escape my wrath of judgment, the harvest of seeds that they have sown. The great season of their judgment shall be openly known. My David shall step up and all this who say nay will see my anointing come down. The moment of truth shall echo around the world with a resounding sound. A sound of shock and a sound of awe. A sound that the world has not heard. I say my kingdom shall advance and ascend upward. Up, 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 I say. Up, up, up and away. Away from the noise and all distractions sent to keep you from being free. I shall remove it all, bring it down, for the time is now and you will see. What you have waited for and the time that you prayed and stood on the wall working for me, I say, shall now come forth in my time and in my way. Earth government shall fall and the handcuffs and shakes the chains shall break. You will be free at last. I do it all for your sake. For enough is enough. It's been difficult for you and for me. But now you are awake and have the eyes of my spirit to see clearly. For it's taken time. Time again, I say. But the day from night shall now surely shine bright. But the day from night shall surely shine bright in a big way. Are you ready? My question to you is this. The great transfer of mega is here for you, my children. And for my faithful, you will not miss. Do not stress or worry. No, not one ounce. For the King of Kings is here and I am here to release the crowns. I will crown many with new mantles, many with new assignments. I will establish a new president and a new way of life for you. It, if it were not true, I would not share this with you. A new president, president of life, and yes, a president too. My David is coming to reign again as I have promised to all of you. It will all be new. For now is the time that I will do all and more than I say. Get ready for mega in a huge and a resounding way. For the year ahead will be one of huge shifts, huge changes, and removing old patterns too. It will be the year of lift, I say unto you. I will lift you up and move you beyond the past. You will arise like an eagle and be swift in the skies at last. From the old ashes and dust of times past, you will rise up like the phoenix and move into a life of blessing that will last. Listen to me this day, my children, my faithful ones, dear and true. The time I have prepared is just in front of you. So get ready, I say, to experience mega blessings from my hand. 
The time is here to see all and more I've prepared for you in your land. America, Europe, Middle East, Africa too. All of the earth, your king is here and I give it to you. Though the world will shake and the doers of evil will stand in angry shock and awe as they've nothing left from their fall. I say to you, my faithful, it will be your turn to run, your time to honor me and lift up my son. You will be my hands extended to those broken and hurting too. For the time of great glory and mega blessings now comes to you. So lift me up and shout and dance. For your king has spoken and the year ahead shall be blessed not by chance but on purpose as doors and gates open wide. The heavens are rent and my treasury house is released to you inside. Get ready to experience my waves and my glorious tides. For suddenlies, miracles and debt cancellation too. All and more I give unto you. Houses and land and properties too. All and more will be given to you. No more of wondering how you will do this or how you will do that. I say watch now the clock and see my hand resolve all of it. No more doubt. Hear my spirit as I speak to your heart. Feel my love repair and heal what the enemy of your past has tried to tear apart. I will heal in this hour. I will restore and I will do what no one else can do or can be done. This is why I tell you to smile and prepare and to get ready to run. You will move now into a life of blessings that you have never seen before. Time for release is now that I have in store. So happy Eve of the new, I say unto thee, when the clock strikes 12, you will walk into a new year that I have prepared just for thee. Happy New Year with all of my love from your Heavenly Father above. Wow! wow. Jesus! And to Him be the praise. And to Him be the glory. For good is the word of the Lord. Come on, let's give Him praise one more time. My God, Jesus, we honor You. Jesus, we bless You. Jesus, we praise You. Hallelujah! We give You praise, God. We honor and bless You for what You're about to do. Oh, my God, I feel You strong. Oh, Jesus. Thank You, Lord. Thank you, God, for what you're about to do. And we hold you to it, God. And we stand on the sure word of prophecy. We stand on the word of the Lord. We stand on what the Spirit of the Lord has said. And it shall do what it was accomplished to do. And it shall not come back void. We give you praise for increase. We give you praise for healing. We give you praise for the abundance. We give you praise for mega. We give you praise for huge. We give you praise for more than enough. We give you praise for the wealth. We give you praise for clarity. We thank you, God, for all and more that you have in store. We bless you, God, and we thank you today for it all in Jesus' name. We thank you, God. Holy is the Lord. Holy is the Lord. And we seal the word with the blood. God, let it happen today on my wife's birthday. Jesus, let it happen. Jesus, do it, God. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 My God, I feel Him. Woo! Mighty, mighty God. I'm telling you, you better get ready. I was up later than I wanted to be. Believe me, that word. And I literally, I sit there and as He was giving it to me, I would literally pause and be like, my God, is it time? And He would start again. And, and as He began just to let it roll, 
My little hands were hurting from typing so fast. <laughs> but to God be the praise and to God be the glory for all that he's done and about to do. Those of you who are online, just type right now, I receive it. And those of you say it, amen. amen. You know what amen means? So be it. That's right, Catherine. So be it. So we speak amen and see law. It is so. It is done. We decree and declare it. We speak it. And now we are accepting all and more that you have for us. Because we have waited, Lord. And we have stood and we have prayed and we have believed. And we've walked in obedience. And we've done things for you that you've told us to do that people thought we were crazy for doing it. But God, we've done it because of our love for you. And so today, Lord, we thank you for all that you are about to do. And you have seen our obedience and you've seen our sacrifice and our giving and us loving you with everything inside of us. Not just by what we've spoken, but what we have done. Our actions have proved our love. And so now, Lord, I thank you that the people's eyes are open. I thank you that they're open not only to your spirit, but to all that's happening in the world where those who thought that they had the upper hand thought that they would uh, manipulate and keep us in darkness. You have awakened the people and you now are letting them see what has been taking place, the lies that have been given, and for years and years, what has been uh, shown and shared that's not even true. And so, Father, I thank you that in this new season and time, as you've opened our eyes, opened our spirits, God, you've said so much in this word. I'll have to go back and read it again. That's the first time that I even read it since he gave it to me. So it was it was just so much. And I was so exhausted. My eyes were closing when he was giving it to me. It was two in the morning before I got done. But, but to God be the praise and God be the glory. And you know, this whole week, Mary Ann, God bless her and I love her, but she's turned on prophetic words of other people starting to speak. And I said, stop! I haven't got the word yet. I don't want to hear anybody else's word. I don't want to know what they're saying. I want to hear directly from the Lord. And so as I've given this word now, not from hearing anybody else speak, I've said, go in the other room. I told her, go in the other room or put it on lower. Put your earphones in. Or I don't want to hear it. I just want to hear what God is saying to me. And then when he gives it, it will be confirmed by other prophets. Because the word of the Lord says that two or three witnesses, right? Confirm the word of the Lord. And so if I be a, an apostle, a prophet, and an anointed man of God, I'm telling you, the word that I just gave is straight from him. And uh, and there's many words I know that uh, Marianne has already told me this morning. Wow, 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 wow. Talking about all the other prophets and prophetesses that have spoken. I'm like, okay, okay, okay. So I can't wait to hear what they're saying and what they've said. Um, but there's so much here. This is rich. It's anointed. I'm just numb right now under the anointing, just feeling him as, as I was speaking the word of the Lord. So it's, it's for us. It's our time. It's our hour, the hour of power. <laughs> and you know, I didn't even realize, but you add up 2024, it's eight. And the number eight is new beginnings. And the Lord already told us months ago in September that we were stepping into the year of open doors. So we've already stepped into that realm and that dimension. But he also told us, I think it was last week or the week before, watch, and last week even I was speaking and didn't even know it was going to come out of my mouth. And he said, New Year's Eve. And I went, what? Because I was talking about Christmas Eve. And I said, New Year's Eve. And I stopped. I said, okay, Lord, what are you about to do? But he, he said several weeks ago to watch the clock. He said several weeks ago, he's, he's told us for three years in a day, he would do it. He's told me when the clock strikes 12 and we've been waiting every day for that clock to strike 12, just to see what it is that he's planning on doing. Come on. <laughs> so I'm saying, be prepared, get ready, be expectant. And I've said this 
all my life for 33 years of ministry around the world, when you go and you come expectant, expecting with expectation, God always shows up unexpectedly. But when you come with faith and expectancy, God will show up and meet you at the point in the place of your heart's expectancy. So get ready for supernatural signs and wonders and miracles. Get ready for suddenlies. Get ready. I'm telling you, get ready. I'm telling you, it's, it's here. We're about to see it happen. Glory to God. And the people said, amen and amen. Glory to God. I'm excited about what we're about to experience. I'm excited about this word. Hallelujah. And um, what he just said. And um, I will be posting this word. Um, you know, so <clears throat> you can look for that. Um, I'll be posting that as soon as I possibly can. Um, probably on our um, New Year's, Happy New Year's poster that we're about to, to put out there. I will, I will put this word so you can read it. And I'll also be publishing it at brettwatson.tv under my prophetic blog. So all the prophetic words, I, I, am, I am terribly sorry. This last year has been so busy with Glory in America that I probably have 50 prophetic words that I have not added to that blog that I need to. <clears throat> so it's been so much. Maybe if somebody's techie and can help me, you know, it would take probably a week for all of it to be put on there. But, um, but I have it all. So all I got to do is email it to you and you can just pop it on there. Amen. <laughs> but I have not had the time, honestly, to put that many words on there to update from the, from the last year. I think the last word that I gave was December of 2022 uh, that's on there. <clears throat> so again, my apologies, but we will work on that. But I will post this word on Facebook. Amen. So you can read it. And um, uh, I'll have it done as soon as possible.